Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a different video. You guys haven't really seen videos from this angle other than time lapses. Today I'm going to be doing a how I package my wallets video. A lot of you guys have been requesting this and I had some wallets to package today. So these are for a secret Santa package which me and a bunch of people are doing. And obviously like I'm not going to show addresses and stuff but this is what I did. So the first thing that I'll do is I'll see if anything needs Velcro and this one does. This one doesn't but I'll see if anything needs velcro and I did cut my hand it's not like this big it's only like half an inch but I figured you guys wouldn't want to see it so I covered it but this is where I will add velcro I don't add velcro right away to my wallets because I feel like they just sit there and it's better for me just to add it whenever I need to to save on velcro so I will put the fuzzy side down first and then the other side and I will make sure to leave some room to grow and then I will pinch up here and there is the velcro for bifolds this is how i package them so since they are open and don't have velcro i will use a painter's tape that i will just make sure that it's all even and i'll add one piece on and then fold it over and then i will let all the air out and just zip the back up and then turn it over and then I will get some tape. This one is the Invisible Matte one by Duckbrand. And I will get a couple inches of that and just fold the bag over and tape it down like that. For bifold, it's the same thing. For all of these, I'm probably just going to speed this up. Okay, so I have my three wallets that I'm adding to this package all packaged up. Now is when I will write a note. I use these note cards. They're kind of like index cards, but I get them at Dollar General. There's a hundred for a dollar. So here's where I will write a note, and I'm going to be speeding this up because this is actually going to be a note that I add into that package. So now that I'm done with the note, I will fold it in half, and then I'll fold it in half again. Then I will write on the note, I'll just put note so that the person that this is going to knows that it's a note. Here's my business card, I will just take one of these and lay it to the side. Now I'm going to get one of these baggies which are smaller than the ones before. Here's the ones before, and then here are these, they're a little bit smaller. And I always put extras and stuff in this, but for this, I am not going to be adding a little bit of candy and stuff. This one's like for Secret Santa, so I'm going all out because you guys know. So I'm just going to add a couple pieces of Ziploc. I'm also going to add a couple pieces of my thin plastic because I don't really use this very often. And I feel like people will get more use out of it than I would to add that into the bag. And then I'm going to add the note in the front. And then on the back of the business card, I normally write extras, but I'm just going to add the business card in. And there's like a little baggie full of supplies. And I recommend either adding them like this in a package, flat, and then adding it on top of each other, or adding them on top and then stacking up more wallets. But for today, I'm gonna to add them in one at a time and stack then add the note and the little bag of extras you guys seen this huge thing of candy i'm going to add all of this candy in here just throw the candy in i'm making one more thing for this but i'm actually going to make it like for her 
so it's technically sort of like a surprise custom because she doesn't know what it is but i'm just gonna add as much candy as i can but i'm still leaving room for the wallet and then i would just close this and write the address on this side but obviously can't really write it on there but i hope you guys enjoy this video this is how i package my wallets and for tape i would do the same thing except for if it's a tape that has like the plastic not with the hole but the plastic if it doesn't have holes already i'll wrap it in something so that it doesn't because some people are picky about that but i will close the package with a cute packaging tape because i think it looks best so there's how i package my wallet i hope you guys enjoyed this video and got something from it a lot of you guys have been wanting me to do this and i hope that it was just what you expected it to be but i hope you guys enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video